it has been storming like crazy outside. Uh, it looks a little brighter on camera. I'm gonna adjust the exposure so you can see what it really looks like. It looks kind of like, uh, like that. Check the framing. I'll probably have to tilt it up a little bit. What if I'm here? Is it too tall? What if I'm here? Am I too tall for this? <laughs> tall, that's right. I said it. Ah! I may get coffee actually before I record. More caffeine? That would be good. Go, 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 go. Oh, it's hot. I don't have an addiction, okay? At least not to caffeine. Okay, so I said that I wasn't gonna do a video today uh, because I have to edit the other ones that I've been recording, but then I sat down to edit and I realized I don't wanna do this. So I found a whole bunch of stuff for me to do. I uh, wrote it down on a list. And this is just on a <laughs> scrap piece of an old design for the wall mounted stands. Uh, I don't. I don't really know what's going on here. What is that supposed to be? What was I trying to do? Oh, okay. I okay. Hold on. Okay. See, look. That's what I was gonna draw. Just like the one down there. Nothing illicit going on. What do you think it was, huh? What do you think it was? You sicko. My God, it's so loud. <laughs> Okay, so these two are working great. This one's having a little bit of an issue. And as far as my favorite printer here, the uh, problem child, I mean the gifted one, I've been in contact with Creality. They said originally that I couldn't return it because I had surpassed the window. But the reason that I had taken so long to decide I wanted to return this was because it was shipped with broken pieces. So it took like an extra week and a half for me to get those. So I've been talking with them. Hopefully I'm able to just return it. Either I'm returning it or I'm selling it. Right now I wouldn't feel comfortable selling it because there's some pretty bad extrusion issues. So later on I'm gonna be fixing it enough so that I can print a single print pretty well and then I'm gonna, you know, pack it up and get rid of it. But I kinda hate this thing. <laughs> it's been nothing but trouble. And I like Creality. I mean, I started everything with Creality stuff. It's just this one in particular has just had issues from the get go and it's it's honestly not equipped to deal with the stuff that I need it to do, which is the mass prints that just kind of print and then push off and keep printing. It can't do that very well. So mm, get away, get away, get away, get away. You're taking up space in the workshop. I got a little project, which I think is going to be pretty fun and it's on the title of the video. So hopefully people actually click on it for that. Hopefully someone's watching this. I realized that uh, for maintenance and stuff, I can get up on my little stool here and do stuff on these printers, but for just starting prints or preheating to change filament or anything like that, it's really annoying to have to take all of these down uh, and then get up there and you know, fiddle with it. So, ah! so what I'm going to be doing is designing something that can basically just mount these display pieces down here like this. So that for simple things like monitoring, I can just look at the screens and activate the screens from down here. And I'm going to be doing that with all of these different printers. There's a few different styles of um, like, I don't even know what this is called, display pieces that I have to design this for. So it's going to take a little bit of work. But luckily, I can do that with a time lapse. Let's get a cook hand on that time lapse. <laughs> what is wrong with this butter? I can't do this one handed. Mm. Mm, breakfast of champions. <coughs> oh my god, I spilled. I spilled like a young child who can't drink out of a sippy cup. These are the three different types of displays that I'm going to be making uh, the thing for. Mm, I'm not going to explain my process. I'm just going to do a time lapse. I got more coffee. Oh. Did I spill it? How did I do that? I don't have a problem, okay? I don't have a problem. It's only my fourth cup of the day and it's 12.56 p.m. And I woke up at 11. <laughs> uh, there's more coffee on the rim. I don't know why I'm trying to save this desk. I've literally broken the handles off of it. No coffee on the desk. No, no. Oh shit, what is wrong with me? Oh my God. This is a disaster. Maybe coffee. Oh my god. 
It's everywhere. Maybe coffee can be harmful. Look at this travesty. Look what I have to deal with. Good lord, I spilled a good amount of it. Jeez. Good god. Oh, better. Oh, baby. I really should have a sippy cup. I wasn't kidding about being a toddler. Like, mm, I can't remember nothing. I can't communicate effectively with people on an emotional level. I can't keep from spilling my coffee. All right, I need to start recording this time lapse before I do anything else stupid. Also, I'm gonna be making a uh, Thingiverse account, posting these for free, so if you have these printers or if you have something similar, it will be posted and it will be available. So this is kind of a tutorial. Yeah, that's pretty cool, all right? That deserves a like. That deserves a, a little like and a little subscribe on the video, huh? I'm trying to trying to grow a channel here, I'm trying to grow a brand, I'm trying my best. It's it's hard in the in in the in the YouTube realm. Prints have printed. I had multiple issues. Uh, my design wasn't flawless the first time. I know that's shocking. Yeah, this is my work outfit uh, because I have a full time job uh, <laughs> as well as this. We're going to get these things put up underneath all of these. Uh, hopefully, it goes smoothly and there's nothing else wrong with it. Because I'm, you know, it's always the hope, right? Now, look at that. I can operate preheat, do whatever for my printers without having to step on my little stool as much as I love the stool. So now if I need to, I can just do a little something on this. Look at that. Ooh, nice. I forgot to plug in my awesome new mic earlier. So that's cool. I don't know if I said anything important. Probably not. Ears. There are forces at play here that are beyond my comprehension. There is something that desperately does not want this video to be made. First, the coffee being spilled. Then, my designs, problems after problems. And now, <laughs> they sabotage my audio, so I have to re-record this. Couldn't be me being incompetent and not testing things prior to recording, <laughs> it couldn't be that. Go ahead and like this video and subscribe to it as well. I plan to make a tutorial kind of walkthrough explanation on how I print continuously, which is where I'll print a part and the printer will reset itself. It'll move the part off the print bed and then it'll do another one. It's huge if you want to do a 3D printing company thing, like what I've been doing, because it really increases your productivity, because while you're asleep, 
your printer is not slacking off. It's like, still going. I think it's gonna be a really interesting video. You know, I've been doing that for a while, so I've kind of refined that process. So, and I'm quite proud of it as well. So if you are interested in that kind of stuff, then please stick around and then I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.